Hi guys, welcome to Family Fun Pack. I'm in the car with Chloe, and we're heading to her first doctor's appointment. I see mama, I know. Thirty-three centimeters. Yeah, uh -huh. There's her weight, which equals six pounds. Okay, we just finished Chloe's little well check. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Was that horrible? I oh, know. She did not like it. I oh, know. She's only six pounds, and she has eight days to gain back to her birth weight or she might have to go back to the hospital and be readmitted. So we're gonna be feeding her every two hours instead of every three hours. She's on our high calorie formula. I know, I know, you're just a little nugget. I know. So that's where we are. After this, I'm gonna go home and get Alyssa and we're gonna to head to her newborn photos, which I am really excited about. First, the two steps I'm gonna do, I'm gonna clean the whole thing, and then I'm gonna get this other one that just does the grout. <laughs> oh, Christine! <laughs> Thought you were about to pull that off the edge. Don't fall. This is a good challenge. We should do a whole challenge like this. <laughs> You step on the tile, you're out. Uh oh. Alyssa and I and Chloe, we're on our first girls' day trip. Oh, that's so right. Yes. I just realized. Oh my yeah. gosh, so true. It's a girls' day. And we so have three excited. girls in the family, which Finally. still doesn't even feel real. I know, right? But we're on our way to Chloe's newborn photo shoot. I'm excited. They're back there cleaning the tile, as you just saw. So the house will be all spick and span when we get there. <laughs> and hopefully this photo shoot goes well. Well, that was awkward. But anyway, so I think the photo shoot's gonna go great. Whoa, my face just turned really away. That was even more awkward. What's wrong with us? Whoa. We have some We problems. clearly do not know how to be YouTubers. Wait, we're YouTubers? Oh, I don't what? know. That's weird. Owen, did you have a good day at school? No. You didn't? Why not? Well, let's go home and have fun with Daddy, okay? Let's yeah. drive by the Earth Movers. Oh, drive by the Earth Movers. Okay, we're going. Look, Owen, there's the Earth Movers. Okay, there's the Earth Movers right over there. Take a picture. Yeah? Did you see them? Yeah. What are you watching, Owen? It's Bodies. Nice. Um, but Bodies has to name it Peter Parker. Nice. While Christine and Alyssa have been gone with Chloe all day, I've been stuck at that computer all day doing taxes and other boring stuff. So I was really happy to get Owen. David and Michael are gonna be home from Disneyland soon. Then I'm probably gonna be going to the gym instead of Christine. While Chloe's still only six pounds, I gotta hit some heavy iron and keep up the dad bod. Somebody's home. Yay. Did you have fun, Michael? Yeah. Good. How was Disneyland? Fun. Good. We had some good rides. Good. I think everybody had a good time. I don't know. Good girl. Where's Owen? He's down the hall watching Paw Patrol. Oh, and I brought you something. <laughs> oh, wait. Oh, there he is. There they are. <laughs> They're donuts. You love Ooh, donuts. Ooh, what do you say, Owen? Oh. Whoa, careful there, bud. <laughs> oh, yeah. Let me go wash my hands. I'll open it for you. Yay! 
Mmm, that looks so yummy. And of course, the same day we get our floors cleaned, we have a milk spill. It's dripping down from right there through here and onto the floor. See you guys. Got some more exciting tasks like laundry. I just opened the fridge and I found another milk leak and I found that this was a culprit right here. Oops, made another little spill. Hopefully this will do the trick. Alyssa has Chloe. I have all of her props. Very cute. Yes, and we're heading in. Oh, oh my gosh, I'm already obsessed. Oh my gosh, this picture is gonna look adorable. Oh my gosh, she just made a little smile. <laughs> I'm going to if she does it again. She looks so cute. Strategies now. <laughs> take one off. She's not staying asleep that long. For Good strategy. Now. I like it. Oh, there don't we cry. Go. There we go. So cute. Okay. Okay. This outfit has a little opening at the bottom. So you're going to be nice and warm after this. And on top of this, we're going to wrap her so we can just take off layers and hopefully get lots of good pictures. You know what, this might not work. Unless we can roll up the sleeves on the inside. She looks so tiny sitting right she there. She does. There's her little <laughs> chicken legs sticking out. Uh, <laughs> her legs are so small compared to her huge head. I know. <laughs> you gotta be so happy now. Mm hmm favorite position though. She's gonna be so happy right now. Back to the womb we go. Yeah. <laughs> oh, she's practically Aww. smiling. Ooh, gummy smile. <laughs> it's taken us two hours to get her back wrapped up. She's like, this is exactly what I wanted. I know. Okay, so we did one outfit underneath because we didn't realize the other one was gonna stick out a little bit. You know, she's all wrapped up. All oh, these backgrounds. This is literally the cutest. Yes, and there's the baby. She's fast asleep. There's all the rest of her stuff and props. Yes, we're getting so excited. These are going to be so cute. Oh my gosh, I love it. Are they cute? Yeah. Oh, good. She like has the best little clips. Mm -hmm. Look at that cute face. She really has like the prettiest lips. Look at her. You are so cute. Look at your little basket. <laughs> so adorable. Don't cry. Oh. Don't cry. Make a happy 
smoothie face on your favorite color. Oh, Do you hear mama's voice? Good job. The sisters. Aww. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yep. She's so pretty. Good helper. <laughs> Our second smile. Are you gonna smile again? Let's see. Do you have a smile for us? Uh, I don't know about that. Who was that? You gonna smile? Come on, Chloe. <laughs> We're both here okay. with our phones. Oh, cute little yawn. <laughs> <laughs> She's like, whoa, stop recording me. Oh, oh look at stretch. that big stretch. Oh, don't make a sad face. <laughs> okay. She's like, I can't handle being this famous. Yeah, everyone's taking pictures of her right now. So too. So cute. We're getting ready for our next little scene. Yes, and she's wide awake, so we're gonna feed her. Oh my gosh. She's like squinting. She's still asleep. I'm currently heating up an apple in my shirt. Because it's too cold, she can't hold it. She'll wake up. So cute. Oh my gosh, that is so adorable. having our after photography meal. And look at her little feet. She's just so relaxed. Look at her. She's enjoying this. <laughs> you guys have fun while I'm at the gym. Have fun, Owen. You in there? Yeah. There he is. Mommy will be back really soon, okay? I'm gonna go to the gym now. At the gym, you guys like my Hawaii shirt? I've had it since 2010. So tell me in the comments if you're younger than my shirt. Well, we did it. Well, we didn't do as much as our photographer, but that Chloe was a really long. Chloe was a superstar. She did so good. Oh my she gosh. She didn't like, have any accidents or anything. She didn't. She didn't hardly cry for more than like a second. She did great. She ate her food. She sat there taking pictures. And looking cute. Oh my gosh. We got so many great pictures oh, and okay. we had a good time. Yeah. It was and a good now, girl's day. We're getting food because we're starving. We've been starving we are all starving. day. We but starved we're, all day. We're good at starving. Yeah. So yeah, we're used to this. <laughs> I don't know if we're proud that we are good at starving, but my hair is crazy. We go a lot of days without eating breakfast. No, we
<laughs> I do at least. <laughs> it's true. We're horrible. We're horrible. But we're oh about to my eat gosh. Look. We're so hungry. Okay. We're going to eat food and we might even get yogurt after this because that's how hungry we are. We're, we're going to eat so much. I'm excited. I yeah, ordered me too. pasta. I ordered a really good sandwich. One thing is though, I'm kind of cold. It's a little yeah, windy really in the city we're out. in and I did not bring a jacket because we started our photo shoot at noon. And my jacket is <laughs> Well, we didn't start it then. I guess we started closer to two o'clock, but we arrived close to yeah. noon. And then it just took a long time because we gave Chloe breaks. Like we let her eat her food. So every two hours or so we gave her a break and then she yeah. ate. So anyway, I just didn't think we'd go this long. So I didn't bring a jacket. Oh, luckily Alyssa did. But yes. I didn't look at her jacket. It says my new one. Show them back. There's Alyssa's food. Mm. Yum. Looks so and good. I got chips, which is normal, but they gave me a free cookie. I she got, got a free cookie. I know. So lucky. And here's mine. So good looking. Mm. Luckily, there was only one lady sitting in here, and now we pretty much have the place to ourselves, which is good for little Chloe. Who's sleeping? Alyssa just pointed out that our new beautiful doll, the one Chloe. right here, is dressed up like Snow White. And we have Snow White right there on the car seat cover. <laughs> yeah. So cute. Alyssa is also nicely carrying Chloe for me because my back always hurts right now. So it's helpful. It's freezing out here. Let's quickly get to the car. We're gonna walk fast. Owen spilled a bunch of spaghetti noodles when I was at the gym, but Michael's so nice that he's cleaned them up and vacuumed them all up. There we go. Teamwork. <laughs> when all else fails, use your hands. It's just Owen and Daddy. And look, come to the place to get orange chicken. Yeah, we're going to get some orange chicken. Yeah, the yeah, thing we're going to do is go back home. Yep. Yeah. Ready to go? Yeah. You want me to help you down? I can do it. You're so excited. Let's close the door. You want to close the door? Yay! Yay, I can run! As long as you're holding my hand. Let's go and get that same Kit Kat I had today. Oh, you want to get a Kit Kat? Yeah. Of course you do. Today was so good. <laughs> I'm going to eat the whole whole thing. <laughs> hey, you guys know what I got, Michael? I did I get some Kit Kats. <laughs> Guess what we got, guys? Is it orange chicken? It is. Yes, I hope so. Ooh, you have to open it. And in case any of you are wondering what Kit Kat Owen was talking about, it's this one right here. Strawberry dark chocolate. We just discovered it the other day and it is so good. Here's a food from Michael, David, Owen, and Matt. If I can get it open. Orange chicken and... Orange chicken with mushrooms and chicken. I love to eat that stuff. Along with some more chicken and onions or something else. Pe black pepper chicken, I think it's called. You guys hungry? Oh, yeah. yeah. And I think there's one other orange chicken right here. Because you get three entrees per plate. Oh, Owen's already digging in with the rice. Let's wash your hands first, okay? Instead of me dividing the orange chicken evenly between David and Michael, I let them do it so they can learn to agree on things and not always have to have a parent involved. Is that not um, spicy? It's not spicy, sweetheart. Mm. I told Owen if he eats all his orange chicken, he could have some of that Kit Kat. Ooh, I like that. You don't like mushrooms? No. I love mushrooms. They're actually a great source of protein. Let me know if you guys eat mushrooms. If you don't, you should. You want to try a mushroom? No. Got to start them young. You want to try it? Uh -uh. Well, we'll keep working on it. You guys got enough food over here? It's really good. It's very really good. Mm. Mm -hmm. We always go for the white rice instead of the chow mein or fried rice because it's healthier. Owen really wants to earn a bite of that Kit Kat. No. So 
Owen earned a special Kit Kat. Ooh, Michael and David, do you guys want to try it? Oh, uh, Go good, so good you would die. <laughs> it's that good, huh? I like it. I thought it tasted like a chocolate dipped strawberry. There's no sponsorship here. I'm just sharing something cool that I found. Strawberry dark chocolate. Michael looks like he's working on his very last piece of chicken soon. Oh, this looks so cool. Yeah. So finish your last chicken and then you get to eat that. And David, you want one? Yeah, thanks. You You're welcome. <laughs> Owen really likes these. He's asking Michael to break it in half. <laughs> oh, good idea. We should do that. We should do like a little reel or short or something like that. <sighs> to top off, our girls' day out. We're splurging. We went to yogurt, I which we don't yogurt. do that much anymore. But tell them what we did. Well, hold on. <laughs> Alyssa had a, a deal. Well, on my account, I had a free 16 ounce, and I didn't get yeah. 16 ounces. And I was like, Alyssa, get the free one. I, I, I was getting a normal, regular ice cream. She's like, Alyssa, get 16 ounces. I was like, whoa, I'll try. <laughs> so, so she just kept piling I it did. on. There was so much on it, it was I like know, falling off It was off falling the top. off, so I had to put one of the cookie dough balls in hers. <laughs> That's what I'm eating. But hey, it's good. Their cookie dough here is so good. Plus, it was free. Well, yeah, their cookie dough balls free. were like that. <laughs> They're good. They're so good. So, I mean, like. It's worth it. It's a good I mean, splurge. it was free, so. We'll call it a cheat day. I mean, we didn't eat all day, so we're not even like eating our full calories anyway. Yeah. But, yeah. <laughs> this is a fun day. <laughs> Okay, we got home and basically chaos ensued. I got Chloe out of the car. I asked Matt if he would help like get her ready for eating. So he took off her diaper and realized she needed to get a little bath to clean her off and everything. So we put her in the sink, which is what we normally do, like just right there, just a little bit of a bath, not a full bath, because she still does have her umbilical cord. Anyway, he's in here bathing her. And while he's doing her bath, I was adjusting the water temperature and I don't know really who did this. Actually, I'm gonna guess it was probably Owen, but somebody put Vaseline on the handle of my sink. You can see right there that it looks kind of, you know, greasy. moist, greasy, yes. Anyway, I didn't really think much of it, but I grabbed my candle, because I have this candle I love to burn at night, and I went to light the candle, and it literally slipped out of my hand. I don't really even know how it happened like this, but I was standing like right there, and Chloe's taking her bath right there. So the candle slips out of my hand, but somehow it also cuts me on two different fingers. And one of the cuts was kind of bad, like it was bleeding a lot. So I'm pinching my finger, trying to keep it from bleeding. And then all of a sudden, Chloe's like peeing everywhere. And Matt's like, oh my gosh, but we're trying to get her out of this sink because we don't want the glass to get on her. And it, I'm surprised it didn't bounce up and hit her, honestly. It was really lucky that it didn't. So then Matt takes her to the other sink and you can see some of my Band-Aid mess there. And then she starts pooping. <laughs> and I, so my mom's on the phone this whole time because I called my mom because I was going to tell her about Chloe's doctor visit this morning. And I'm like, oh my gosh, I'm bleeding everywhere. The baby's peeing, the baby's pooping. There's and broken <laughs> there's broken everything. glass everywhere. We're just about to clean it up. It's like, oh my gosh, what's going on? This is where some of the glass landed, just right there. It just landed on the sink and then it somehow hit this. It's like it went under a lip and candle pieces got here. And then the rest of the candle broke there. The there's big, piece of big pieces of glass under there. I mean, there's glass there. There's glass in this rug. It's just such a, it's just a yeah. mess. This is just a horrible mess. And then, of course, I'll show you the most embarrassing drawer in my whole house. It's right here. This is the Band-Aid drawer, but I couldn't find a Band-Aid. So I have this little small Band-Aid on the smaller of the cuts. I mean, this Band-Aid here was like a little too big. I mean, it, this drawer's a nightmare. Because the kids use all the Band-Aids. Because <laughs> they always need a Band-Aid. <laughs> but this cut here, I mean, it's already starting to bleed through on this Band-Aid again. It's, but someone's pretty big. It was like over a half inch long, I would say. So David's getting his first experience feeding Chloe because we were like, hurry, just feed the baby she needs to eat and we have to clean up this disaster going on. Guys, I did want to tell you one thing about Chloe's doctor appointment that I didn't mention, but um, she got her first vaccine today, one vaccine. The doctor really insisted she get it, so I let her get it. And um, at her pictures, she had a bandaid on her thigh. So I was like, oh, I'll just take the bandaid off really fast. So I very gently took her bandaid off real slow. And then there was a little piece like kind of stuck, but 
She screamed so loud. I've never heard her scream so loud in my entire life. I mean, it was really bad. She never even cried like that, getting IVs, getting her heel pricked, none of that stuff. Even the photographer, she comes running and like, what happened, what happened? Because it was so alarming, this scream that she did. And I was like, I don't know, she just didn't like that bandaid coming off. I don't know, you know? And so I was just kind of sitting there trying to process, like, why was that hurting her? And I'm looking at the bandaid, which I'm holding right here in my hand. And I noticed the bandaid wasn't sticky. And I thought, that is so weird that a non-sticky bandaid would hurt her so much. And I looked at the bandaid and I'm like, well, there's stuff on this bandaid. Then I realized that the bandaid, I don't know if you guys can tell, I know there's a tiny bit of blood on there, but um, all that white on the bandaid is her skin. And this Band-Aid that's way too big for this tiny little dot of blood, um, it ripped off her skin. It just completely ripped it off. She's red and raw with these large wounds, like the size of the Band-Aid sides, on her poor little thigh. And I, I was so upset when I saw this because I was like, how does this happen? So Alyssa looked it up on her phone. It says online how premature babies don't have as much time to develop their skin and the skin cells and tissues as other babies do. And as a result, they have thinner skin. And I was just like, oh my gosh, I didn't know this. Obviously, um, the nurse, I guess, didn't know this <laughs> because I was just thinking we could have done a little tiny circle bandaid, no bandaid, a cotton swab, a gauze wrap. I mean, there's so many things you can do that wouldn't ruin this poor little girl's skin again. <laughs> she's already got that rash she's dealing with and now this, and I could tell how painful it was for her. Even now, it's been hours, there's just this red open area of missing skin. And I was like, I gotta tell you guys this because any other moms of preemies, like just be careful with their skin. I had no clue that a Band-Aid could be such a harsh thing on her little, her little leg. She's down there sleeping right by me. Somehow we even got candle wax on Matt's shoe. I don't even know where to shake this out. There's so much glass. Oh my gosh, I can hear it falling. Can you hear that? No, that's it's like cracking inside. Oh my gosh, there's so much. Shake it in the street or something. I don't even, have it over the trash can, just in the trash can. Yeah, I can do that. Oh my gosh, be careful walking here. We're gonna sweep, we're gonna vacuum, we're gonna mop. Um, yeah, I guess for now we're just gonna say goodbye. <laughs> it was a really good day, but I came home and like, this is just stressful. So, and my hand hurts. Like, I don't usually cut my hands. Um, yeah, it's late anyway. It's, it's pretty late. So we will see you guys in our next vlog.